Du, 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 du. Wait, where's the wolf? Wait, we should teleport to me. There he is. Oh wait, this this is not not a big though. Once again, hmm. Oh, sludge. Ooh, sludge. Not having any of that. Well, this quite a spam. What's this spam? What is it? overgrown greens? Yeah, I definitely want to put it in the fur in the fur forest though. What carnivorous forest is it called? Yes, carnivorous forest. Because these trees are all carnivorous. Some cotton plants there, which I'll obviously grab. Oh, I'll also a ravine where I can do some mining. That's a kind of, that's kind of like a weird kind of. Oh, pumpkins. Oh, this is kind of promising. Maybe not actually. I'm just trying to find a mountain. Not a mountain, like a small hill. This like an obviously like a hill. Hmm. This is quite cool. This might work actually. But it's really neat. I wonder maybe in the in the centre of the forest. Right. Here's a kind of hill. Kind of, that's not more. I just want to get upstep and land. Right, I might just go for that one that I saw over here. Then. Oh, there is. This one here was it? This one? Nope. Where right, is this one here? If not, I can just go down anyway, right? Let me just sort of mind this a little bit. So I've got an actual place to go right now. I'm just gonna just my little entrance now. Just so I've got somewhere to put my stuff and rest until the night is over. There we go. Put a couple of torches up. There we go. And then put my cabin bench down. Uh, is it coming from Wolf? I'll get a f name for you. And wait, can we get a stone chest at all? Wait, let me see what type of, actually, let's see what type of chest there is. What have we got? We've got reinforced silver, zinc, just iron. Emeralds, diamond, I don't know what the difference is. I'm not too sure. Uh, look into it. Uh, but anyway. Trap chest. I just want to, yeah, those these are probably bigger then. Uh, oh, what's this? Oh, these chest plates. Cardboard chest plate. Um, yeah, so. I'm going to just nip outside. Because I don't have an axe anymore. So I'm going to have to go and see if I can find maybe like a small tree somewhere. Like this one here will do. Wait, do I have a space for it? No, I don't. Yeah, I do. There we go. Let me just go and actually... Wait, I thought it was a wither spider there. I was like, what? But it's just a wither hat. Uh, I'll get a couple more of these. Just so I can build a chest as well. Then I'll go and make an axe. And it'll all be dandy. There we go, put him there now and just dump all this junk in here now. I need that. There we go. Brilliant. And now I'll just sticks. Pair dot axe. Pair dot shovel. And a pair dot sword. Uh, axe. So put it there like that. Actually, no, I'm just gonna, yeah, I'm just gonna keep on that because it's nearly done anyway. I'll just hold on to the stuff now just because I've got no room for it in there. 
Yeah, let me just just keep that in there, just ditch that. Yeah, so let's go and take the rest of this tree. So I found a place to stay, that's good. I'll put a mark on the map actually while I'm here just in case I die. Uh, that's the base, there we go. That'll do. What's the height in that? 78. Why is it different? Oh, because it's the same height as I am, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, that goes really fast now. Oh, yeah. Let me just fly. Oh, it's quite good to have this bat ability, so I can just fly top of trees. And then. Just straight up from the top down. <laughs> Lovely. Oh yeah, I just realised how bad my food is. I might have to go back to that. Um, what's called that village? Let's see if I can get some food. Let's just wait. The mushrooms here. Oh, there's a pink tree. There's a mushroom tree. Wait, I don't know if you can turn hay bales back into hay. I don't think you can. Uh, wait, sorry. <coughs> I apologize guys, but I don't I don't think you can no. Hey, where's the village? So I'm going the right way there, it's over there. Right, we'll see if we can get some vessels and stuff from there quickly. Cause my hunger is running very low. Yeah, I'm gonna try and see a farm or something. Well I'm already level th th uh, twenty nine XP, that's just like mining basically. Some sheep there, I'll come back and get them as well, so we'll make a bed. Set my spawn point at the base so I'm die miles away after walk. Um yeah. I also don't know why there's this little it's this little silver uh, kinda waypoint thing. I don't know what that is. I up always points towards north. Yeah, so we get hurt because I've not got any food. Should we see the village soon? Come on, village, where are you? There you are. Come on. I I don't know if it to one heart or half heart, I can't remember. Oh, Sean, please see if you've taken all the fields. Ah, well, there we go. Um, well, that wasn't fully grown, that's fully grown. That's fully grown, that's fully grown. Wait. I don't know if I can make balls with that, but I'll try. There we go, come on. Uh, well, can't mention me, no, but I can make one. Uh, three bread, three things. Anyway. Oh, there we go. I don't wait. Don't switch like a bowl. Let's see if you can do it with this. Hopefully you can. And no, you can't. God damn it! Let me just be, take this garbage with me. <coughs> what's, what's inside this house? Is that a witch again. Yes. Um. Anyway, where's the pressure? Sure was another field somewhere. Where's that one? Is it, oh, there's sweet in this one. Yeah. I think we try a sprint, but I can't forget. I can. Uh, like that. Uh, where's my crafting table again? Like that. There we go. I need some a couple more just so I can heal myself up, but I'm gonna go and see Actually I'm here I may just grab this Tigger's construct stuff, eh? Got a pattern chest. Uh not a pattern chest, the stents I've got a pattern chest now. Uh yeah, so we it was iron. Yeah, see if it was maybe... It was maybe uh, paper would have taken it, because paper is quite good for making uh, things. Paper is quite good for making uh, what they called. Oh, apothecary. Pressure's a chest over here. Oh. That one looks nicer. <laughs> I'll see if I've got a pressure sort of apple somewhere. I don't know where. I need food. Wait, can you kill sheep to get food? Yes, you can. What was that? Raw mutton. That's all I need. There was also a furnace over here. Let me just go and cook this up quickly. 
Yeah, if I could drop. Uh, that I've got no, no need for. Well, furnace, 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 furnace. Uh, there we go, cook that up. How the first like, three episodes will just be me trying to find food, more or less. Go and get this bit of wool. <coughs> Excuse me, is there any other kind of. Uh, I'm trying to find that there's a witch's thing over there. I'm trying to see if I, can, I don't remember if there was food in here or not. I'm not too sure. Oh, there was. Oh, thank goodness gracious me. Oh, there we go. Lovely. Some bread. And oh, there's a rubber tree actually. Yeah, well, anything I don't need. Actually, I've got a. Sp nah, I don't need. A handguard. I've got so much handguards ones. I don't need them. Uh, we'll just break this down, see if we get some saplings from it. There we go, there's one. Because these trees aren't the most common to come by, but you do, I will need them later down the line. Oh, there's another one. Uh, three. I'll see if we find one more down about here. Oh, there we go. And go get my mutton. I can't remember how it was. It was this house over here. Yes, it was. Right, let me just travel back to the house. I'm not getting great FPS over here, I don't know why. Well, I say I'm not getting great, I'm getting 70, but. Compared to what I was getting earlier on, right. This is my house over here, yeah. My house is like quite away from, way away from everything else. But I like that. I like to have some spread out. Oh, there's a cheap there. Oh, that's my sword broken. Actually, just quite a couple of sheep here. I'm going to go and kill these guys just so I can get some food. Just so I've got a steady food supply. Well, not steady food, just so I've got some food supply that lasts me a little while. Oh, we're having the sheep now, won't I? It's okay, I can roll with that. Lovely, some sheep, and I saw another sheep over here somewhere, oh there he is, there's one over here as well, that'll do me. <sighs> two seconds guys, I need to just sort something out. I've also noticed some of the textures have changed in this texture pack, which I've noticed which look quite nice. Like, I'm pretty sure that sword just, uh, for some just looks a little bit better than it usually does. Don't know why. Just think it does. Just my opinion. But I always have thought the Peridot sword looks coolest. You know, I remember it used to be called Emerald Swords because, like, it was before Emerald added it. See, anyway, I just realised I just said that these trees were really hard to come by. You look, there's tons of them over here. Maybe that biome was just good for spawning them, I don't know. Mm hmm. Oh, I should be over here somewhere. Yeah, there's a the biome I live in. I need to come get those pumpkins. I should just get those pumpkins now. I've got an axe on me anyway. Whee! I don't know. I don't have any use for pumpkins right now, but. You never know. Might come in handy one time. Wait, none of these have their faces. Why do none of them have their faces? Shown at all. Yes, it's got all four sides, you can't see it. You wanna break it, it's got its face. Wait, see, let's see how long I put it down. Yeah, it's got a face. I don't know why, but in the, it goes in the well, it doesn't seem to have a face. Never noticed that before. <laughs> maybe a new thing, I don't know. Actually, you know what, I just realised maybe the tools looking better, because I'm maybe using a, I'm just, uh, using a higher resolution text for that. Sorry, guys. I'm using a 128 bit. Because I was using the 64 but the last time just to just lag because I don't know why but the last mod pack seemed to be quite intense on my computer for some reason. So I can run any game in the max settings. 
but then you come to modding Minecraft and it just always hits the fan. Right. We're in our chest right now. I also build a furnace as well just while I'm here. So don't cook the those mutton. Turn to human again. Oh, where's that chest gone? There it is. Maybe I'll just shove that in there and get some coal. One, two, three. There we go. Everything in there. Gonna keep that on me just in case. I love that feature that most mod packs, the fact you can just do that. Let me just fill this up. And where's that wheel? Oh, one, two, three. Half of that. Make a bed. I'm gonna make a carpenter's bed for the because they're pretty cool, like I showed you in the last mod pack. Well, right now, this'll do. Sleepy times. There we go. Go that mutton there, you know, put it, just put it up there. Right. Uh, right guys. Tell you what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna cut the episode here. And I'm gonna do some work on this house. On the house, but on the base. I'm gonna build make it all look nice and build a proper kind of a, st a basic establishment if I'm gonna stay in. And I'll be right back. Both well, will be like a second for me, it'll be probably a couple hours, so see you in a minute guys. Bye bye. Hey guys, welcome back to uh, Mods Files Season 2, or well, something in a new episode. Welcome back to the same part episode, guys. I guess in the first part, I said I was going to construct my house and do my things and get the, the base, well, not the house, I was going to get the Mushroom Incorporated news, new, I could have ruined it. Got, yeah, I found some XP bushes as you can see here. Yeah, I found the Mushroom Incorporated um, base camps up and running. Sorry about that, guys. Eh. Uh, so yeah, here it is. Huh, just a small little thing. No. See, uh, last time I built, we started building the house, and we didn't really do much in the house in the last Modded Survival, Modded, yeah, Modded Survival Season 1, so I thought I'd just up, go straight to and build a place where it actually works, so. There's a weed door for well, here. I've uh, got common stores, you can see some marble, some chilled cobblestone, that shouldn't be there. Uh, I've come through here, and here's my main part of my house. Well, this is the main part of base camp. So you can see I've got four doors here. I've got the front door here. This is going to be my tinker's room. This is the mine down here. As you can see. And then this is my secret entrance. So if you come over here, I didn't realise this was so close to the exit, but these are, as you can see, grass blocks. These, what these actually are, is if I come in here, my blocks chest, these are ghost blocks from Secret Rooms mod, which you can see is easily craftable. Um, but as you can see, what this is allowed to camouflage the blocks, just walk straight through them. So like a secret entrance just in case I'm getting attacked or whatever and you may like click get away. And then this door here is just stone. Yet to be built, but yeah, I went some mining well so you can see I've got quite a few ores and stuff. This is my ore chest, a reinforced iron chest, so it gives me a little bit more storage. This is a my blocks chest, this here also no, I was in the last episode on that. A tools chest and just my current miscellaneous chest. I went back to that village and got all those uh, body parts. As you can see, skeleton arm. I don't know what it says. I think it's maybe that by the vice it gave. I never played it personally, but apparently it's pretty good. But I think that's probably a reference to it. And over here I've got my furnaces, and I've got like a wee locker here from Better Storage of Ilka, but I think. This has got stuff that I'll need for this episode, actually. Not all of it. Shove you in there. Yep, so this last is good cool animation as well. If you show my inventory, guess who's back? It's Clive! Say hello, Clive. No? Okay. Yeah, they look Clive back, guys. Didn't take that long, it was just as you know. Let me just, uh, oh, no, yeah, it's not that hard to make. Let me just show you. Uh, it just sticks in the chest and a diamond, so yeah, not that hard to make. I went, I went mine, I think I found some more diamonds, yeah. Anyway, here's Clive. I named him at uh, one of the Cameron servers, uh, Anvil, I think it was. I got my wolf here. I don't, don't forget about your wolf, actually. I might just heal him up if I've got any. It's on my brains at all, which I do. Yeah, I'm not going to I'm going to call you... I'm going to call you Timothy. Clive and Timothy. <laughs> but anyway, 
In this episode, the rest of the anyway, after I built my lovely base, I'm going to do, as I said in the last one, start up on thermal expansion. There we go. Anyway, and first, first of all, I've got all the stuff in here I need. I might need more lead actually, but I don't know. And, well, it's going to be similar to this first start up in the last episode. We're going to get one of these steam dynamos, which is easy to make. Let me just make the stuff to go along. We have a little silver actually. Got my silver, there it is. Uh, let me just see, right, oh. Steam dynamo. One of these. Uh, how much did I take one of these? Yep, yeah, just one of them. Oh. One, two. And steam dynamo. I might make a couple of them actually. Like that. And. I don't know why it doesn't get rid of these. One, two. And. There we go. Two steam dynamos. And also an aqueous accumulator. Wherever that is, there it is. Which has a bucket. Lovely. I should have enough stuff, I think. A yeah, machine frame. I might have the glass, I might not have the glass. I'm going to lift the glass over here. There's a the glass. There we go. Who was my accuracy accumulator? Machine frame, that one. Machine frame, and. A servo. That, and. Bidding, bada boom. Wait, what am I missing? No. Bucket, damage servo, machine frame, iron iron, silver. Oh, it's tin on me, tin on me. I have to tin in here. Yeah, I did. I knew I had plenty of it, but I just wasn't sure where it was. Ah, Chris Accumulator! Woo! Yeah! Look at all the stuff I need over here. Um, and also, they're going to need a pulverizer. Let me check one of these. Oh, God, look, see, I didn't get my wood ready. I hope. Uh, what else I need for us? I need flint. Oh, I'm going to need flint. And that might be it, I think. A pulverizer. One of those pistons. Machine frame. I got a glass, yeah, but I think I'm going to need one of them for the rest of the forest. I'm going to. Yeah, I need a machine frame for that, so let me just smell it up. Eight more glass. Oh no. Let uh, me just do that. There we go. I'm sure I don't have any coal in these ones. I don't think so, so. And one coal. Smell that up. And pulverizer. What oh, one of these rest on? Does it require any one of these for the one of them? Yeah, I do. So let me just get two of these. Pulverizer. Oh. Pulverizer! Yeah. Let's see what stuff away from that. Uh, what else I need? I need to make two sets of brick for the. Redstone furnace. I need a glass. Yeah, it doesn't take for this. No. I'll tell you what, I need to make another bucket though. Because I need to go and get some water. I need to get two bucks of water, but. Oh, that clay fell on me. Uh, let me just go and get. Yeah, I found those two experience bushes when I was mining. Oh, those two, those four. I think I found one a while ago and I found three. When I was messing around. Let's get that. There we go. Clive, you absolute madman. Yeah, I need to strike Clive with lightning again so he can turn him back to music back to his usual self. Back in here. Right. You know what I want to do? Just move you out of the way, Wolf. Uh, Timothy. You go over there. There we go. I'm going to turn this bit into my machine area. So I'm going to clear away these two holes here for my uh, machines. If I dig underneath here, uh, I'm trying to think of maybe a way I can set this up. A clay stop running around. Um, I think I have a way I can set this up so I can have my aqueous accumulator and stuff down here but I still got a way to put um, coal into my thing so let me just make a couple of item ducts and then just put it so it sucks it out of the coal and puts it into the uh, steam dynamos so I can uh, 
just keep refilling it so it doesn't run out. There we go, lovely. And just mine out these three blocks here. Aqua's accumulator, there you are. I'll put you there. Is this again water by itself? No, I thought maybe it did. There's no water there is. It's taking water now. Right, that's really slowly though, but. Hey, let's turn it back into a bat. I'll put Clive back down again. Once I get back up. I don't know what a zero is. Up in my corner where I was holding Clive there in my hand. Don't have to do with tools. I don't know what it is. Well, experience push, yay! So now we can get experience again. I don't need a one, need a little for, uh, 38. It says 48 there. There we go, some more water, lovely. This bat thing's a lot more useful. Couldn't we have this in the last mod pack? Because there's a lot more kind of, like, ways to get around flying. But there's not really much ways, only really this. The advanced genetics way or the witchery way. But I'll rather do this now. And then we just, yeah, there we go. Yeah, so we get water quick as anything now. We get some fluid ducts. <coughs> Excuse me. Let me think. Then I want to have the power going in the bottom. Of course. So I'm going to probably. Uh, I'll just basically with this now to get through. But I'm probably going to have my two steam dynamos like that. There we go, and then my fluid ducts like that, and we're good to go. Yep, fill up with water, fill up with water. And then what I might do is I might get. Oh, I'm not made any item ducts actually. Whoop! Oh, how would you make them again? I am duct. I am duct. I am duct. Lead and tin. I don't think I've got one lead. Don't know. Yes, I don't know how much they make. Let me just check. Nope, they make six. That should be enough actually. I put a chest, let's say here. Oh, my apologies there. And I'll put up. Oh. I am not there. 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 And there. And yep, let me just eat a steak. Where'd Clive go? Is Clive underneath here? Where's Clive actually? Where did Clive go? I don't know. Last I saw him was over here. There it is. I must have stuck over here somehow. Ugh. Got him. Come get a book, Clive. Why did he go too deep for you? Oh, I don't know where it went. Oh, he's out there. What's that? Well, that's one of these weird, what are they called? Entity, Naturalists, I don't know. Let me just break you. Oh! There we go. Quickly, grab it. Oh, that was close there, I know. Nearly died. Uh, bat. Um, yep. Flying up. Oh! There we go, this way. Over here, oh, there's another one bush. Ah. I don't think so, Sony Jim. No, Timothy down. Is he really doing this so he can't stand off, for goodness sake? I'll kill him. Get rid of that. Oh, he's going really fast. Is that Timothy sitting down there? Yes. Stand there, Timothy. <coughs> I'm inventing yourself, chock a blocker. <coughs> yes, I'll say I'll make a chest. I got eight wood there. Got no wood at all. What's that wood? I've got wood on me, yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, sorry about this, guys. It's got a bit of a bad cough today. Uh, and yes. I need to make a crescent hammer. If you can swear as it at there is. Which is a ten oh ten and three iron and I don't even have three iron. Wow that's embarrassing. How much I've got tons of iron here? Let me just smell up some. Uh 
Yes. I'm going to put these here. Pulverizer first. Oh. And then followed by resistant furnace. Resistant furnace. Did I not make it? Oh, I must not make it. <coughs> oh yes, that was why, because I didn't have the machine frame. That was why. No, I don't have iron. There we go. I can make my uh, crescent hammer now if I go with this. Crescent hammer. Ooh, I wouldn't do it as fast as. Well, that's messing around with itself. Uh, if I slide in here. Just do this. And then suck out, yes. And then it should be. Round robbing means it gives it to everyone equally, so that would be what I want. Let's just get coal in here. Put 30 in here right now. 30 in there right now. That should be that final power. Yep. I'll set this up while I'm here. Uh, configuration, nothing in there. Top one should be blue. Nothing there, nothing there. This one should be orange. There we go. Lovely. Let me just go and get the iron over here. Should be enough, I think. Oh, uh, one of these. Sorry, I forgot. One of them. One of them. Rest on furnace. Plonk. And uh, blue. Should also be blue. Nothing there. Actually, yes, put that to orange. Nothing there. And then we'll go and get a dynamic servo. There we are. One of them. And what else we do if I put this on a item duct? Probably shows in the last season, but just so I didn't see that. If I right click on there, this allows me to whitelist stuff, but it also allows me to I mean, no resin, so I'll just suck anything out instantly and put it straight into here. You see, it's all well filled up. Yep. So if we go and get some ores and show what it does, uh, we get the iron. Iron's over here, isn't it? Oh, there we go. Go and plonk it in here. Boom. This should start pulverizing it up pretty fast, and you'll see. I don't appear here, will it? Nope. But if you go in here, iron dust, and this will just smelt up. Lovely for this land here. And there we go, seal it all up. And I won't get a chest quickly. And plonk him there. Ugh. Yep, start filling up iron. And that'll allow me to basically automate the process of my ores. Yeah, and I'll go and so go on if I show you my coal. If I start putting my coal in here. That in there it should get taken out. And if I break my way down, wait, this is 28, 34. And just jump up. Come on, there we go. I see 34 and 28. Put two in. 28, 33, 29. 34, yeah, so I was putting one in every one, so yeah. There we go. Let's put half a stack in there right now. I should keep it going for a while. Let's block this back up again. Lovely. So it's basically the same kind of setup we had when we first started off in the first these, but yeah, a little bit different. So we also made luggage. Oh, Clive, sorry. I love you, Clive. Mm. I uh, built a lovely base, so yeah, good start, and we'll uh, see you next time, guys. So, bye from me, Clive, and Timothy. See you guys next time. Adios.